Hey folks, welcome back to X4. We are uh, going to continue, um, but I first want to give you a bit of a situation uh, report on what's been going on. Um, I've been building, I've been really enjoying the game, just some basic uh, basic uh, factories, just um, coolant and refine and all of that stuff. But there is a bit of a problem with my location. And the problem with my location is we have been attacked so many times that I... Um, I had to spend about 10 million to create free ships to secure my position in my own territory. Not only, not my own territory, but at least make sure that my ships don't get killed as often as they did. And trust me, they do die a lot. Um, when we go to player information to logbook and you type in destroyed... You can see that we've lost one, two, three, four, five, six, six ships. Uh, times 1.7 million. So uh, I'll leave the map to you, but I'm going to say that's roughly 10 million as well. It's 20 million. We could have spent elsewhere, and uh, we could have um, could have done a lot different. Now, this um, has bring uh, this does have this. Has given me, sorry, it's from a live stream, <laughs> the um, the idea of claiming my own territory. And uh, we have not done so at all. So, yeah, that's going to be nice. For now, we uh, let's on pause. We are currently going to be landing over in uh, one of the bases. I've never spent so much time in a yard as I've done in the Hopper Pyramid Wharf. Hopefully... Not too many station messages for you, which is fine. It's an uh, interesting way of landing. I'll give you that. We'll just rush off the docks. Hopefully we will uh, not get too many messages. Usually you'll get these station messages when there's pirates or when there's combat or when there's criminals. And there's no way you can turn it off. Also... Um, these sort of messages that you see over here, this is a bug. Um, I've posted that on the form. Luckily, there's a moderator telling me that it is a known issue. And yeah, so let's do the uh, receiving rank first because you will need to do this. Otherwise, you are unable to get yeah the pyramid admin. As for the others, if you can hover over these... You can see there's actually not that many things you cannot get from um, not receiving the rank. That's three. It's four. Uh, that's not even true. Three of the production modules you cannot get if you are not a honorable member. So it, it doesn't change all that much. Let's just go and receive the rank. We remain moved that such fire burns within one such as yourself. It is something worthy of a grand gesture, of which we can bestow. With the holy light of the true Pontifex, it is an honor to bless you with a new title. You will find that your position will include a number of benefits. In the event that you turn against us, we will wrench this title from you and serve judgment. However, with your noble character, we do not expect such a thing. Go and make these rewards your own. We pray they help you continue on the path to enlightenment. You may also find that certain sanctioned groups with our order will have gained interest in you. You will do well to not reject them. I again recognize your holy will. May the true Pontifex continue to guide you. Safe journey. And there we go. We've received the rank it's and an now you. we are actually able... To go to modules, defensive modules, and get the admin center. And I want to get the defensive bridge as uh, as well. Uh, at some point, we will get the discs in as well because it's it's so nice to actually make corners like that. And uh, we will also go to equipment turrets, get the um, the cheapest large one, which is the pulse, and the cheapest medium. Which apparently is also the pulse. You know what? No. We'll get the bolt. 
and for shield generators we'll just go with the uh, these two mark ones leaving us not that much money but that is fine Safety let's get all of these let's uh, get in my ship and I'm going to send my uh, my little sentinel over here Doc and oh here we go again stop uh, get my fleet they are going to attack also attack you attack you attack you and attack you so that is going to happen I want to be off the station so we don't get too many of those annoying messages let us go in and build our very first defensive um, yard let's go plots create a new one yeah we could place that down here or something in here like um, well it is a defensive station still they would go towards some of my factories no I think I want this like halfway in my territory as a, a backup defensive station so we'll build that over there for now let us continue and put on uh, the environment it's so absolutely great to see what is around you um, can I see where's the gate come on where is the gate I think it's over there I think that is the gate okay that's fine let's get back into the center of this doesn't really matter but eventually we have a lot of um, of ship positions in here let's place this somewhat centered I quite like that and we'll place down a bridge bridge and we'll do bridge flip you around there could be sometimes it could be quite difficult let's not do this one let's just uh, copy module place you down there and we are not using missiles yet uh, we can also do the docking point from behind so if enemies come in they will have to deal with the, those other areas first but actually that's not a bad idea let's place it down at the uh, at the back now from for this one which is let's edit loadout we can go with a low preset it has some defenses a medium at least we'll get a large one by the looks of it too but it's all from one angle yeah that feels a bit dumb you know we'll go high preset we'll go high preset we'll do the same thing over here it's pump that up completely don't know why it doesn't do that from the start we'll have a great amount of defenses on this um we'll have to build this out completely relatively fast we'll save this as um a basic save as new confirm loadout changes we'll just do the one let's confirm this we'll go to oh man that's already two million Let's hire ourselves a builder. And I think it would be best if we start and get some cash. Let's go to account. Well, it, unfortunately that is not enough for what I like. So I want to go back to the map. Go here. And usually what I do is just tell you to I want you to keep 50,000 currently we are also providing our factories with our own produced energy so the factories themselves they don't really require anything so that's nice I'll just do that with everything get as much money as possible because once this is done we are going to be moving our facilities. First, I want to make sure that we uh, have that defensive structure going on. 
Let's confirm that. How is my navy doing? Looking good. Yeah, looking great. That's good. Let's continue off over here. And let's give you all the money you need to start working. Do we want to just get those bridges up and running as well? Let us take how, let's see how much money it would actually cost us if we, um... okay, this is the good one. Let's go back. Let's go to you. Put on basic. Number three. Basic. And number four. On basic. If I confirm this, actually it's not that much more. However, we do want to make sure that this is no restriction. Otherwise we won't get anything but the uh, the energy and we need a lot actually the hull part's not a huge issue the claytronics isn't um, i'm worried mostly about the shield and the turret components but at least we will have somewhat of a solid uh, position in here it um, it won't be fighting you know large ships the capital ships but it should be enough to uh, fight uh, the rest of it so when that is done we will have started our very own um empire which is uh it's going to be cool i, I really do like that these guys are you waiting for something here yes you are uh go ahead and protect till further notice i could use you to Pick all of this up. The ship will be undocking I like picking all of this up. You never know when you need all of this. And if it's free, it's free. And I'm Dutch and I like free stuff. There you go. Ah, let's dock and wait over there at the base again. So, we've been losing quite a number of ships. And it has been devastating. I don't like it whatsoever now of course we could build turrets and all on the stations they only have a range of, of like four four thousand no four four kilometers and that's it not something i would say let's write home about that do you have anything in your inventory no you have not let's say goodbye let us go to personal backpack yeah we have four million in our back it's it's a lot of junk that i've collected unstable crystals a lot of them 437 i can't wait until we can actually sell those off because that is a um, definitely a good amount and i will have once this is starting to break down the three uh transporters they will start to uh go over there and I will transfer the manager as well, who is what kind of level? He currently is a level 2. So this is one system. So 1, 2. We need to start placing down satellites in Pious Mist uh, 2, in Unholy Retribution, Pious Mist 4, and Pious Mist um, 11. Or we save up and get the trade from that faction. Now, this changes the entire game. As you can see, we need one more point to get into a better position with them. They're friends. That's always nice. And we need to get 12 million and plus 20 relations with the God Realm uh, Pyramid in order to get the trade subscription. And I'm, I'm actually... Could we bank on that? I don't think so. We will have our ships deploying satellites. And we'll just see how that will go. Now, we um, I'm going to be cutting out for YouTube. And I will be meeting you back when something actually happens. Or when the construction is about to get started. Which is most likely going to be a while. I might have to bring... 
my ships in order to protect over there, which leaves these stations extremely vulnerable. And I don't like that. Apparently you're already... You're back. Oh, everything was destroyed then. I hate that. At least that won't happen with our own system. Are we going to send them in for reinforcements? I don't know. Well, see you in a flash. And there we are. Well, what I've done so far is I copied all of the bases from these, um, these places. And I placed them on a line because we have a highway. Utilize it. If you have it, utilize it. Just do it. We're still building the defensive structure over here, which I believe um, is... It has its docking bay. No, no, not yet. Not yet. The admin center is almost done. Now, um, because I'm, 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 I'm an idiot and I want to do all of these things at the same time, and it is a lot of work, I went around and I checked if it was possible for us to build a SATA. And we did! We actually were able to build it, which um, is amazing because what we will do now is um, very drastic. We're going to destroy all of these. Remove sequence. I love that option. It is so damn good. And we'll confirm that. And we are going to do this everywhere and you may say oh there's no need to do that well i think it does because i want everything in at one place for now because i have plans i have massive massive plans always remove these sequences that is done confirm that now why do i want to do it like this uh, quite frankly i um by having everything in the same place when we declare war on a faction which will happen in the future we will not have to worry about our own um, our own stations. Especially when they're in your own territory. You will only need to worry about defense instead of... Well, I, I'm going to declare war on, say, the, the pyramid. Unfortunately, I have 15 bases in that territory. And now I need to defend all of them. And that is... Uh, that's annoying, to say the least. Now, I know we will spend a lot of time doing all of this and i know a lot of resources are wasted this way as well in terms of what is in the storage that i've tried building a a sort of a supply base but it had a negative effect on my economy which i do not uh, uh, like what we can do at some point and let me know how you feel about that is we'll build the trade stations again and if we build that trade station we will most likely build it around maybe somewhere right here in the middle but if then fleets come in it will be in the, uh, the crossfire so I'll probably build it around here and have defensive bases just around this area. We can also just put a fleet in there and everything that jumps in will create a nightmare for them. Now, that is um, about all of the bases. We can now unpause the game and I want to have a bit of a talk about what happened uh, when I was starting with this. Let's put on our Seda and let's go. So, what happened is... I have I did all of this uh, before in the same in, in this game as well what happened I placed down oh my dog is making so much noise um, I placed down research probes and they started hovering which is a known issue for this uh, version we're in and one of those probes made this map about as large uh, it's about the circle I'm making right now, which really is annoying. It really is annoying. It is. It's. It's definitely no. No fun to do so. Seda is still on. That's good. Um, and I actually went out flying towards it myself. Uh, we have these guys patrolling my ship, so we don't get hurt by him. Uh, 
I went down flying there myself because when I had the NPC pilot fly towards it, it wasn't going into sort of like the sublight speed, so it wasn't in uh, going towards my eight thousand. Uh, meters per second it was just hovering there at 425 and it would have taken him about five real-time days to get there and then he has to go back so I flew there myself went down there for three hours almost reached it and then I was like wait I need to fly back and I was not going to do that <laughs> <laughs> that was not going to happen. And um, I decided just to um, redo this bit. And uh, hopefully you approve on that. What will now happen is the second you will see some of these will go to, um, say, you are now a factory. It, is mean, it also means that they are done. We'll use our army of transport to start flying from the base that is furthest away you can actually now see that the defensive station is done and it is also uh, over here we still need some goods and especially the shield modules they will take the longest eventually they will come do check that you are not using your own trade rule like I use with all of my stations they can only trade with me if you are building your defensive stations when you're building all of this and you are replacing all of your <laughs> stations you do want to make sure that everyone can just bring you there so there's storage component coming in that's actually for the survivability and we'll build we need to add more small shipyards for the drones if we are ever attacked and we want to launch about 50 drones we have a lot of stuff in here that we will get uh, we definitely pick up when uh, we are ready to do so so for now what i will do for you guys on youtube is i will cut away and i will show you when this is all done yes you're welcome <laughs> see you soon <sighs> Wow, okay, so I've actually made it, and, <laughs> okay, uh, you go bloody escape, please, uh, <laughs> I, I, oh my god, guys, um, so let me tell you what happened, this is the third attempt I had to do, what I did was the dumbest thing ever, so we're currently at my admin station, and you can see that is my, my limited defense platforms, what I did is I removed the other stations that were over in these regions and I uh, I didn't check for the materials and half my factories didn't build and so it's great, it's good. <laughs> Don't be a daily. Make sure whenever you move a station to one, get your manager out and two, Always make sure that your storage says zero wares. If you don't, you will most likely be me. And you will have a very, very nasty aftertaste. I did this during a stream and even the guys watching said, yes, I've never seen someone doing this dumb. Of a move and you can see that over here there is wares over here there is way too many wares over there and i thought i actually got rid of those we'll uh, move those back using um, this trader uh, actually we'll move it back using a different trader are you doing anything oh for crying out loud they're all working why is that they're all doing stuff amazing how good is that? How good is that? Okay, we'll just do it with this guy. The graphene factory is over here. Right click transfer wares with build storage. And it looks like it is actually on the ship. Yeah, it is just picking it up. I know I did something right. And where exchange? Yeah, buying that up. And you will bring this back over. To the solar power plant, transfer wares with Napoleon Dwarf, 
put that over there where it belongs. I don't know why it brought more than I needed, but it did. Um, it, it actually did. So, with all of our stations over here, and I've actually managed to drop in uh, one resource probe somewhere. Oh dear. Where is it? Oh yeah, it's because it's it's starting already. Um, unfortunately, he will start moving off. He will drift. It's a problem in this version. So let's get my sentinel and say collect before it is absolutely a ap most nightmare. And actually, it was over here. So, once you pick that up, I want you to come back. Actually, no. Look at this. Look at this amazing stuff. Um, collect all of these drops. Always check if they're all in. You can see I have to move it downwards. Just, uh, shows you how flexible we actually are. Well, no. Not really. Take that. And then collect these drops. Move to the side. You can actually use the um, the W, A, S, and D keys, which I um, I usually forget because I do play a lot of these paradox games. And is it actually worth taking these? Sure, they are. Drops are drops. Beggars can't be choosers. That's a space egg which I uh, I still sometimes sell for. Roughly a million. And that is still good money. That is still good money. Then I want you to dock and wait. Maybe I'll move the dock and wait up first. And we will head towards the uh, faction representative of either the, um, the God Realm or the Pyramid. Currently, in terms of our relations, we have the God Realm at 15. And the Holy Order of Pontifex. We... Um, we have that on 24. So soon we are going to be the honored guards. I will I will get the police license because I can. And I actually want to start saving up to get the satellites. And I'm going to do what everyone is suggesting I don't. I'm going to be picking up the majority of my satellites. Um, there's a few reasons for it. One, I don't need to see all of this. And uh, second, yes, I'm building two defensive stations over here. It is for a quest. Uh, for those of you who are, who are wondering, mission manager, it's these two quests. I actually did the other one as well. That's why I'm having four million. Hello. I can't do this one because we need engine parts. So I'm building two stations. And once they are done, and we're waiting for the advanced electronics over here. I will um, turn them in and we'll get some uh, money. Uh, the amount of money is scaled. So you will gain 50% of the value. So if you spend uh, 5,500,000 credits on the station, you will gain 11 million. And this also includes the, pro uh, the plot price. You don't need to do this. Uh, I think the station by itself cost me 2 million. 1.6. I would be getting the double... Hey, come on, it's it's a good return on this. So they're great missions. You don't have to do anything for it except building the station, which is just good. And just pay attention that you either get four defensive modules, one docking area, 30 turrets, and six shield generators. And for the other one, I actually had to go and buy... Uh, where are you? Is it this one? Yeah, missile turrets. Yeah, that's the one. 16 turrets, 8 missile turrets. So I got those. And what we'll do right now, which I will start doing, of course, is that we're going to be expanding. I also took the liberty to fly towards the end of this line. And it is just an end. <laughs> There's nothing more. There is nothing more. Did he already pick up that um, that thing? I think he did. Oh, man. This, this line is so damn good. It is so damn good. Unfortunately... I will have to start placing some uh, more of these resource drones, otherwise my uh, my factories will start complaining about the lack, the atmo absolute lack of resource drones. Which I find absolutely weird is that there are 
humans, the Lodi, I've seen every species that is in the known universe, even Terrans, which is in the unknown universe for me. But still, look at that, using the uh, conveyor belts, it's, it's oh, I love this game. <laughs> I love this game so badly. Ah, oh, wow. Okay, well guys, um, I'm not going to drag this out for you any longer than it already has. We've built the admin station, we've claimed the territory, we've moved all of our stations, and what we will do next time is we will get Bojata, we'll get the research station in the Taladi territory. We will not buy anything for that station, so perhaps I want to make sure that I'm actually getting Claytronics, hull parts, and I already have the energy cells, but those three we will need to actually buy that station and build up the docking yard and everything else. So, thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.